Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be learning how to rescale and resize images in GIMP. Now uh, there are two common uses for this. The first of which uh, you would use when you actually want to rescale uh, your original image or resize your original <laughs> image. So to do this we're going to open um, just a simple background. There we go. So we have our background here, and maybe it's uh, too large, maybe it's too small, and we would want to look at rescaling or resizing this image. So there are two methods, and it really comes down to personal preference. Um, the first method is you can go up to your uh, menu bar. You can go under Image, and then go down to Scale the Image, and then this box will come up. Now, right now it's 1920 by 1080, uh, but let's suppose we want it to uh, resize this for 720. So you could actually put 720 in the bottom box and hit scale, and then it will rescale it for you in proportion to uh, 720. So if you go back under the image and then go to scale image, you'll see that it's now 1280 by 720. Now what if we wanted to uh, resize it but not in proportion? Um, we could do the same thing and when this box appears you'll see this little chain link right here and basically you just click that and you'll see that this chain link is now broken and once it's broken I can put this to whatever I want so let's suppose I want 1500 but I want this to stay at 1080 and then I'll hit scale and it'll now rescale it to 1500 to 1080 okay so let's undo that and now we're back to our original image the other way that you can do it is by using the scale tool Okay, once we click the scale tool, then you'll see that this box comes up again. Um, but you also have these squares here that you can use to readjust it. So if we want to just rescale it in proportion, we can just do this and grab one of those squares and move it up and down and rescale it as large or as small as we want. Okay, or if we don't want it to be in proportion, again, you click this little link. Once it's broken, you can scale it however you like and have it at whatever size you want okay great now the second time we would want to use this is if we're actually adding a layer and this one is the most common um, so let's say we want to put a logo on this background so we can then open the logo and as you can see, maybe maybe we want it larger than this. Maybe we don't want it quite this large. So instead of using the image menu for this, we're going to go to the layer menu. And when you click the layer menu, you'll see that you can scale the layer as well. So once you hit scale layer, this box appears. And you'll see that you can grab and resize this as well. So you can just grab it anywhere, resize it to whatever you want. Let's make it larger here and then just click scale and then we can click on the move tool and kind of move it around to position it just you know as we would like it. Okay so that's the easier way and um, also um, we could again click the scale tool if we wanted to use the scale tool. The important thing to remember here is that this layer tab is clicked. If you're on the original image tab and you try to do this, it will just scale the whole image. That's not what we want. So if you make sure that you click the layer section right here, then you're grabbing the layer. And then you can just resize it again. Click the Move tool and then move it wherever you'd like. Okay, that should cover it. So that's everything you need to know about resizing an image and resizing a layer in GIMP. 
Um, this is helpful for when you want to uh, reformat the size of a background or if you want to uh, scale uh, a logo or an image so that it will fit onto a background wherever you would like. So if you've learned something today, please hit the like button, make a comment, please subscribe. Uh, this really helps me out with the YouTube algorithm and uh, it'll help this channel to grow. The more this channel grows, the more videos I'll do in the future. Um, thanks and have a great day.